I would like to present you the LTC reader built for the iPhone and iPod Touch. You can connect it to an LTC signal. We just have here a standard player and shuttle a little bit back and forward and you can see that it can even read it if it's slower or faster. It's connected via the audio input using the line input or microphone input. You need a small adapter cable which is able to feed it through into your device but usually that's not a big problem. There are several adapters around. Also some microphone docks with a line input you can use that. Here you can see the actual video. It's a PAL video which we display in this example here. Just one which I did in a former time for our TV show. And down you can see the LTC readout on the iPhone and the upper you see the original LTC. Here we have connected the output of a portable timecode generator to the input of the iPod. And there you can see the same time code. This is an NTSC signal. This generator is very handy because it can generate different time codes in NTSC PAL and so on. And just for testing, we use that device here. Mm -hmm.